What's up guys, Computer MD of Gilbert here, and today I'm going to show you how to prevent and possibly remove a virus from your computer. So let's dive right in. So I'm going to show you the four programs that you need to protect your computer entirely. So the whole system you'll have protected and it'll run smoothly and it'll even speed up your computer a little bit. So the first system we're going to talk about is Avast. Uh, Avast is very important. Um, you can see you'll open up Avast. And I just got the 2015 version. You want to make sure with all of your programs on your computer that you keep them as updated as possible. So with Avast, it's pretty simple. Once you get it, by the way, I will include a link for all of these programs down in the description below. And they are all completely 100% free and trust uh, you're able to trust them uh, so Avast you go in here you go to scan and then you could choose one of these you could choose a quick scan you could go into your scan options you could scan for viruses network threats performance issues always just go scan for viruses and when you get Avast a uh, nice thing I like to do is just look over the settings quick so it'll open up and then I always look for the tools and I always get rid of not get rid of necessarily but check off software updater browser cleanup and rescue disk uh, it just helps it run smoother and you don't need all those programs running from one antivirus software so that's the first one the second one is malware bytes kind of like a vast but this is great on picking up your adware and your malware and trojans and stuff like that so we'll open up malware bytes quick by the way a vast is always good to run eh, maybe once a month um, some people might want to run it more than that maybe once every two weeks um, and that should be a good amount to run it now, anti uh, malware bytes, anti malware is also very simple. You would just click scan now, and then it would go scan for your viruses, your trojans, adware, malware, spyware, all of that, and then simple removal. Again, I would also run malware bytes about once a month, maybe once every two weeks if you really want to just stay up to date on it. Our next program is using free registry cleaner. This helps clean up your registry and get rid of all the junk that you do not need in your registry that's kind of clogging up your computer and registry in particular. Uh, all you have to do for this is scan registry issues. Once the scan has finished, you'll be looking for options on there. But no, all you do when the scan is finished is you click repair registry issues. And it's that simple. Cleans up your registry, gets rid of those issues. And finally, the last one I'm going to show you is Auslogix Disk Defrag. Uh, we'll open this up. It's a very simple process. Uh, it just defragments your hard drive, your disk, um, because a lot of times you'll have fragmentation on your hard drive. And it just helps everything run smoother with your computer and cleans it all up and defrags it hence the name disk defrag uh, so that's the last one pretty simple you just click defrag right there and bam just let it defrag and let it go through its process it'll let you know when it's finished exit out and you're good to go after you have ran all of the scans that I have showed you I always recommend restarting your computer that way it registers that the changes have been made and that it could go back and start running smoothly again so these are all tips to prevent uh, viruses for sure, and most of them you could remove the spyware, adware, trojans, all those types of viruses. For more serious issues, there's complex ways to go about it, um, and maybe we will cover that one day. But for now, thank you guys for watching. I hope this will help you prevent any viruses from your computer uh, and just make sure to stay safe out there on the computer online be careful when you're downloading things for now that's it please give me a like a comment and please subscribe to me here on youtube computer md of gilbert because i will be bringing you guys more awesome tutorials and tech videos in the future until that point i'll see you guys later thank you